Hello, Jess Too Good here, back from our video. Today we're reviewing a LEGO Junior's Iron Man vs. Loki set. It's 66 pieces, two minifigures, and it retails for $13 in the United States. Now let's take a look at those minifigures. So here is Iron Man. What's really cool is that this is the 2012 version, uh, which is very hard to get because it only came in the Quinjet set. And it's one of my favorite versions, actually, because of how, I guess, it looks like the original Iron Man from the movies. And you got these two little beams right here, which are supposed to be, I guess, you know, energy or whatever, which is odd that they use in this set, but they usually use studs. But I think junior sets don't use studs usually. And then we got his face underneath, which is just a classic version right there. You got a smiling face. And then on the back, you got a more angry face. Here's Loki. I love his torso and everything like that because this is the 2012 version from the Avengers sets, much like Iron Man. His one-sided face doesn't have any back printing, nor does his torso. And they did update the Scepter right, the Spectre right here because it has a crystal in there. Um, so they updated the look to fit the movies more. And his cape is a different material, it seems like, but I might be wrong. And here is the car. And then there's a separate build with the Cosmic Cube container and this little part right here. So the car itself is pretty basic. I mean, it uses the same Junior's frame that all the Junior's cars usually use, which is that one right there with the bolted kind of axles and everything like that. Now you get it in red. Nice printing on the front, though, where it's this little hood piece, but it has some Iron Man-esque printing on there. I really do like that print. And there's a seat for one minifigure, so you can fit Iron Man in there. There's also a little printed piece on the front that says Stark, so that's pr pretty cool. Little beams on the side of these little rods, and uh, yeah, very basic, and it looks like an Iron Man suit as a car, so I think that's pretty funny. The kids will enjoy it, but the adults will like it for the pieces included, like those little prints on the front. Now, the rest of the builds are just this kind of, I guess, security system to hold the Cosmic Cube container. Uh, very, 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 very basic build, but I do like getting a 2x2 two two yellow jumper. And then you got this little container for the Cosmic Cube, which they changed the color to make it blue. Uh, usually it's a trans clear. And it's just kind of held on there. Very simple build. Uh, little handles that are a nice pearl gold color. And you can just kind of put it on the jumper. So that's it for all of that. Very basic box, of course, because it's junior sets. I love how it has an Iron Man logo with uh, that's from the comics. You haven't seen that on any other sets. The back is right there. And the instruction booklet is very easy. The best part is a little artwork, and you can see it looks kind of cute right there. <laughs> all right, so kids will love this, all right? But I don't judge these for the kids, because the kids will like this for a car, Iron Man, and Loki, two very popular characters. But the adults, what will the adults think like me? Well, I really like this set because it's an easy way to get Iron Man and Loki from 2012. It's only $13, and you get some interesting pieces to boot, like a hood and the printed tile. But that's really it. There's not really much else to offer. There's not much else interesting pieces. I mean, there's only those two printed pieces. So I'll end up rating this set a B for the adults. I think it's still a good value, but I don't know. I think, like, the Snake Showdown is a much better value than this. But uh, then again, adults don't tend to like Ninjago as much as they like Marvel superheroes. So I don't know. So that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.